Hello again, I'm Blunty. It's time for another thrilling Gadgeto Gizmo review. The only problem I have is today's gadget is not particularly thrilling in any way. In fact, it's quite frankly kind of boring. It was sent in by the guys at electronicswarehouse.com.au and it is called the PowerMate Super Universal Smart LCD Charger. Uh, hooray! It's a battery charger. How exciting. Why would I bother reviewing a battery charger? Well, it's quite simple. I'm a massive gadget whore, and one thing that my gadgets all have in common, everything I love runs on power, and most of the things I love run on battery power. Some of those have built-in rechargeable batteries, some of those you can't be removed. Hey, Apple, bastards. Uh, some of them just run off regular uh, batteries, like, for example, my handy-dandy little panel light that I use on my camera when I'm out and about to get me extra light. That's a couple of standard AA batteries right there, which is terrific for devices like that, because it means if your battery goes flat, you're not stuffed. You don't have to find somewhere to recharge it. You can just slam in a couple more batteries. And that's why standard-sized rechargeable batteries still exist and are still hugely useful. And that's where this little beastie come in. Happy for guys like me, battery recharging technology has come a long way since I was a kid. And batteries took 14 hours to charge up and were flat within... Well, in some of my things, eight minutes. I had a remote-controlled hovercraft when I was a kid. I loved it, and it would take 14 hours to recharge the batteries, and I would use it for eight minutes before it needs recharging. That sucked, and it really annoyed my mum. She was not happy about that at all. She made me return it, as a matter of fact. I miss my remote-controlled hovercraft. Anyway, back to the review. This little guy does everything you want a battery charger to do. It charges batteries, but... It's got a built-in little computer in there which makes all makes sure the batteries get charged properly and has an automatic timer shut off in there and when they get to their full potential it doesn't try and overcharge them. It's got fancy things like negative delta V protection in there which nobody really knows what that means but it's important to keep your batteries at their tip-top healthiest condition. You can charge up four at a time in any of the standard sizes, you know, AAA, AA, C, D, 9 volts and... and well, it charges batteries. What more can you say? I mean, it's not a particularly exciting review. You've got a little display screen on there, so you can actually keep track of how well they're charging. It's not focusing. I don't know. Well, you can keep track of, you know, which batteries are charged and which has still got a bit to go. So you can charge a mix of batteries at the same time. Lovely, handy. But the reason I wanted to actually give a video review for this thing in the first place is because it does something that no other battery charger I've ever come across does, and it is amazingly simple, but amazingly handy. And it's on the back. That right there? USB port, which means you can set this thing up in the corner of your room. You can figure about you can have your batteries charged and ready and all you're ready to, you know, off you go. But you can stick in your USB devices there and a lot of stuff with built-in batteries these days. The stuff you can't pull out batteries and chuck them in there, all the all with non-stand proprietary batteries, you know, the little slim things and in and, and your cameras and bits and pieces. You can't, you don't get those, you, you don't slam them into a charger like this. It, it's a pain in the ass sometimes. But well, this with this, that becomes a non-issue because most of those things will charge over your speed. The iPhone does a lot of cameras do it these days, and uh, it's it's wonderful to be able to have one place. You know, you don't have a, a mass of cords and different adapters coming out of the wall and plug adapters and all that sort of stuff. You can sit that there. You can do your regular batteries, and you can do your USB device at the same time. You just go bang, charge. It's all there. It's all taken care of, nice and simple. And that. That right there is, is the key feature I wanted to point out in this otherwise boring review of a battery charger. The other thing I wanted to point out is the electronicswarehouse.com.au guys uh, sent along two different kinds of rechargeable AA batteries for two different kinds of purposes. And this, this is really clever as well because again, back in the day, you know, when I was a kid, my parents were always buying batteries and then finally got a battery charger and all that sort of stuff. And the batteries were relatively low capacity, a lot tough to look after. The, you know, the technology was, was at infancy because, you know, I'm three decades old and we're talking a while back now. But now it's a whole different story. There are two different kinds you can get. And they, they both do the same job. They're both batteries. You charge them up, you put them in, you use the power. You charge them up, you put them in, you use the power. And you can do that, you know, thousands of times. And that's all glory. But the thing about the, the difference between these, these two batteries is... One of them is designed for absolute maximum power. So you've got high drain uh, appliances like, you know, your cameras and things like that. And, and, and the other ones are designed for stuff that aren't high drain. You know, they've still got a relatively good capacity, but they're specifically designed not to self-discharge in any significant way over a period of time. That's the biggest problem with, with cer certain types of battery, rechargeable battery technology that come on top, the nickel metal hydros and stuff like that. If you sit them in a drawer six months later, they're dead. When you need them, you pull them out of the drawer, they're dead. You've got to go charge them again. But they've got a, a special kind uh, of battery that's designed to hold on to 
almost all of its charge. I think uh, if I can find the pack around here. After six months, they keep about 80% of the charge. After 12 months, they've still got about 70% of the charge left. Genius. There you I, go. I know it's not exciting. I know I wasn't particularly witty or, 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 or funny and I didn't get to do you know, really cool stuff. Oh, look, well, it's got a feature. It does that when you press the button. Oh, oh, oh. isn't that fantastic so there you go super universal smart lcd charger really ridiculous name probably translated from chinese to english by someone who only speaks german but it is a handy dandy product and the batteries come with you you've got the high drain ones and you've got the ones that last and god look usb port right in the back there for charging usb stuff that that is why i love this thing I, I, it's genius i can't believe it's taken this long for me to stumble across something like that that it's i mean you know, it takes a, a USB port and a little a little regulator chip to, to feed out the 5 volts for it, and you're done. I can't believe I haven't been aware of that. I can't believe that's not more common. I can't believe everything doesn't have that. I can't believe I don't have a USB port on my toaster for, for charging things up. I Actually, that would make no sense, but there you go. Essentially, what I'm doing here is reviewing a battery charger, which is, like I started out, is a completely boring but essential device, and I'm trying to sound excited about it because it is, you know, a good thing. I'm trying to sort of... I'm, I'm, I'm pumping up the enthusiasm a bit and trying to seem excited and make this worth viewing instead of just some boring nitwit sitting at a table with a with camera in one hand and shaky cam trying to talk about the charger in the other like so many other of, of the other people who, who look at gadgets and gizmos do on this site and it's pathetically boring and tedious and monotone and I just want to sort of sex it up a little bit. Battery charger, yeah! Get down with your nickel metal hydride self. <laughs> Who am I fooling? I can't make battery chargers sexy, but they are useful, at least. Which is more than can be said for, you know, a lot of people, really. Oh, I'm sliding into cynicism. It's time to end this. <laughs> I'll catch you next time.